What species of waterfowl is eating itself out of house and home? That's today's news. Since the 1970s, the snow goose population has exploded by 1,200%. It's now estimated that their uh, population sits somewhere around 15 million birds. And they all gather up in the Arctic to breed every year. If there is a species of waterfowl that has the potential to eat itself out of house and home, it's snow geese. There was a time, however, when their numbers were very low and a hunting ban was imposed back in the 1900s. A century later, their ranks have swelled to over 15 million. Biologists are concerned that, left unchecked, there is the potential these geese could do serious damage to their nesting grounds in the Arctic. There is habitat degradation. We've seen localized events in uh, breeding grounds of the mid-continent population. It hasn't been proven that, that there's significant destruction, but in, in staging areas, there's localized uh, habitat destruction, which could potentially impact productivity of other birds that maybe aren't doing as well. Environment Canada, along with ESRD, feel one way to have an effect on controlling the snow goose population is to offer a spring hunting season. We will be hunting the Western Arctic lesser snow goose, as well as Ross's geese. The Western Arctic birds were, were far behind in terms of their, their climbing numbers, but they're increasing at a rate that lesser snow geese from the mid continent population were increasing historically, which is a bit alarming because we've seen what happens. Dr. Caswell is optimistic that a strong turnout in hunting numbers and filling bag limits could be an effective management tool. Well, I hope you enjoyed this story. If you did, please hit that like button and be sure to subscribe to my YouTube Let's Go Outdoors channel. Till next time, I'm Michael Short, Let's Go Outdoors. Music